here we where's my phone here we are there we go and uh, let me grab this uh what Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, oops. Now I got to pull up. You gotta pull up the thing. You gotta pull up the thing. All right. Hold on a sec. All right. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. All right. Okay. So it is making sound. It's just. It's just muted. Alright, so, volume's at a nice, decent level. Let us. There we go. Begin. Hello, my name is Max, also as Electro. Welcome back to Fatal Frame the Tormented. Let's see, I think I already did. Uh, did I do Did I do a Nighty Patrol yet? I don't think I have yet. Um, yeah, let's, let's start a Nighty Patrol. Let's see, on the last episode. We started playing The Tormented. The base premise, from what I can tell so far, is that this isn't so much a haunted location that we are going to. Instead, it's like it whisks people away in their dreams to this, like, manner of sleep. We already met one person who is consumed by this tattoo the more that they are in there, and this tattoo... That's the wall glitching. That's not a ghost. That's the wall glitching. And, um, we've been there a few times, and the tattoo on us is, get, is growing bigger and bigger as, like, the influence of the place is reaching us. And every night, we have the ability to go around our house. Now, so far, nothing has happened. But I can't help but feel... The more the day, the more the game goes on, kind of like Silent Hill for the room. Which now that I think about it, I don't actually know when this came out in comparison. I, oh wait, we already did the, we already did the patrol because she was right here and she's probably gonna. It's raining again. It's raining again. Yeah, that's all. That's all she says. Okay, never mind. Me and my mature nighty will go to bed. But um. Yeah, I get the feel on the longer we're here, the more things are going to start showing up. We do have our own camera in here, but, yeah, I don't know. So, let us go to sleep, where we are going to be whisked away. Hold on. And continue the adventure. Things are getting better, as you can see. Yeah, last stream we didn't get very far because I was, um, we were running way late preparing what's going to happen on Wednesday, hopefully. So. Yeah. This place is... Oh, she... I'm a sucker. The subduing song, hour three. I'm a sap, so I'm gonna follow. I'm gonna follow my my fiancé. My fiance. Oh shit! I missed. Yeah, that's right. Oh god, that's right. Let me get all up close on you. Yeah, there you go. Blast back, motherfucker! Oh, I miss. Oh. I think that still got him. Oh, barely. Um, is there multiple or is there just him? I think it's just him. It sounds like there's multiple. Thanks for missing. Yeah, we fought this guy before, I think. Oh! I don't know if that got him. Ow. 
Well, wasn't this the direction? This was the direction the one guy went, so maybe we need to go this way. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, oh, oh. so. Another projector room. Oh shit, that's right, I forgot to um, develop my one photos. Ah, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, I'm not worried about it. See, it's fine. Maybe I'll just real quick. Oh. While I, while I continue my research, or while I continue my research, I stumbled upon the existence of the shrine that was perhaps the origin of the sleeping priestess. The shrine is very small and hidden away within the depths of a mountain. It appeared just as in the drawing. There are normally no worshippers, and according to stories from the small village nearby, it is a shrine where you could offer your pain. When I called upon the head of the family, she said they allow visitors until the snow melts. They carry out a rite here to protect a sacred area in the mountain. That leads to hell! Men are not allowed in the rite, but it seems every few years they invite men in order to continue the bloodline. They call them outsiders. I think that I've heard of a similar custom with the Amish. The guests who come in winter while the snow falls all hide their faces and pull large bundles on wagons. It resembles a funeral procession. The rite carried out on their behalf must be connected to the song of the sleeping priestess. A track. function it automatically faces ghosts when your camera is at ready you'll automatically face in the direction of the nearest hostile ghost that's pretty nice all right that's dope uh hey yeah, got some film it's pretty it's, pr it's pretty good pretty good ow i got a sore in my mouth again hold on i got a sore in my mouth right here it's kicking my butt yeah mouth sore is always kicking my butt but you know ooh who the fuck are you ooh you're not like I saw like you're not like the lady I saw earlier uh Nice. Um, I, I don't see anything there. Like, no, nothing's... Uh, oh, it's... Some, someone's... It's the image of someone taking a poop. Taking a poop in the corner. It's rude. Yeah. Alright, so if I remember correctly, this is now the outside. Alright, so that's how we would have gotten in before. Okay, well. Uh. Oop, gee. Well, I guess that answers the question of where I should go next. But I was gonna take a picture of that. Maybe just something has been con the photo. No. Oh. So yeah, I hear songs. And I get that much more concerned. I have to remind myself, this is a horror game. Because whenever I stream games, I have a weird habit of forgetting that they're horror games. Oh, oh, oh. That's a girl about to hit you with the hammer. Now, if I had to make a guess. Oh. All right, well, I think I know where she is. She's too, maybe not. Maybe if it's, I, I know I know what the room looks like. It's, it's like this hallway that goes around this like cell. 
and inside was the cell, and I don't remember exactly what she was writing. Probably let me out, let me out, let me out. Oh, shit! I hit the wrong button like four times there. Yeah, that's right, get fucked. And I missed. God, that's a directly threatening ghost. Like, I know it's obvious, but like... Normally, they're not that threatening. Oh. Yeah, push it back. Guy's running at me with a fucking cleaver. There you go. Oh. Little bonus damage. I am forgiven. Shit. Oh. Oh. Ow, that hurt. And he's like right back on me. Well, I got lucky. Uh, you're solid. All right, let's let's leave. Oh shit! That was cinematic. All right. Oh, he fast. He fast. He's got good reach. Nope. Oh. Okay, there you go. Back up. Jeez. Okay, hold on a sec. Um. Use one of these. That doesn't heal as much as it did before. Would just like to throw that out there. That does not heal as much. Um, let's get that max value up and running. I don't think this is... It's not quite half the healing thing. I'm guessing it's like about a third now. Okay. Okay, it should be pretty obvious if this is... Maybe it's the other way. Yeah. I don't think it's upstairs, is it? Dianthus. Oh! Um. Nice! I'll never use it! Not until I get blast! Once I get blasts or zero, shit's on. But until then, ma'am, can we talk about? Can we talk? Can we talk about this? Nope. Okay. Um. I don't think the room is up here. But clearly something's up here, so we might as well move around. Okay, that's the only thing up here. All right, back down. Unless is there more? Nope. All right, right back down. Wait, it's um this way, isn't it? At least once we get the Dianthus key, we know where to go now. So it's good. I mean, I'd like to apologize if I'm a little low energy or a little more chill than normal. So you give an order of my events after work today, we said, Burr, it's cold, because I live in South Dakota. Which, for those of you who don't know, is the Siberia of America. Son of a bitch. Um, I guess that's the only other door. All right, turn around. It's cold, so I didn't walk the dogs. Instead, me and my wife worked together to make... um. Alfredo, and then we cuddled and watched Everybody Loves Raymond. It was a lovely time. I'm gonna wait. Hold on. Was this um? Was this one all the way down here? Was this also sealed by a strong fire? Be real inconvenient if it was. No, it is. It is because that's the one that's that's the one that has like the girl that's that's carving the one thing. Okay, so anyway. Hmm. Yeah. 
Pierre, we were watching as lame as it sounds. Everybody loves Raymond. And I fell asleep on the couch, so today is gonna be a nice chill horror street. Wait a second. Oogity boogity. Oh, I can peek. That creepy. Well, nothing in here. Boogity boogity. I'll scare your dad. 20 points, which anyone can name what that's from. <sighs> so I'm just, I'm in nice chill mode. Is something here waiting to kill me? Cause all I see is some nice film. I get the impression something's here waiting to kill me. I say I'm only seeing brief flashes of it. It's a crawly girl. No, something is totally in here. Something's totally ha Bye. I'd be lying if I said that wasn't actually kind of creepy. Uh, is it this way? Is it this? Is it? Is it this way? That's the room I'm looking for. That's not a... Hmm. On the upside... On the upside, with all these doors being sealed by a strong power, it makes it a little easier on me. Granted, it still has the annoying issue that I complained about before with, um... Oh, wait, shit, there it is. Shit. It's down there. I don't know why the world unlocked all of a sudden. But yeah, it's down there. That's where I'm looking for. That's where I'm looking for. But, um, as the issue that I talked about with other Fatal Frame games, that, uh, because a lot of this is inevitably a repeat, means you do have to sit there and check every door, which can get pretty annoying. Whatever it is, child, you're fine. If you crawl out of these floorboards and try to kill me, I will throw a hissy fit. Child, your mother is okay. Yeah, wow, I hate it. I think it's above me. I'll stick an item. Great. Um, if anything, I know it's not intentional, but that he's rhythmically crying, it almost makes an air of like, yeah, I don't think it's the intention. It almost gives an air of like. You killed Daddy. Wow, horrifying. Oh, God! I forgot you're the ambusher! I forgot you're the ambusher! 
You have to be real aware. There you are. Oh, shh. No, I didn't. Get absorbed on. Unless you're pointing at your mom who's about to kick my ass. Yep, see, you're the ambusher. You try to hold my hand and it don't work. Gabow, little girl. Gabow, twice over, little girl. Yeah, and I kick her in the head. G give, give her a swift kick just to make sure she's dead. Just a little, just a little pacow. Huh. But, um... What was it? I think Aragon looks at ghosts and, um, Dresden Files looks at ghosts in the same way. That ghosts aren't really the people that they seem like they are. So much as they happen to be in the shape of them as more of, like, a defense mechanism. I could be wrong on that front. But that concept is still interesting that, like, they use, like, the objects or things... I don't think I can get in from this side, can I? Wait, no, 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 that's that's little stairs. That's little, that's little stairs right there. And then I can go around, and that should let me in there, which will let me in there. Perfect, all right. But, um... It's a fun idea and concept that, like, they take, like, the body that they're, that they're just happen to be nearby, or, like... The, uh, the energy and memories of things, like objects around them. And they create this facsimile to look like someone else. Not necessarily to trick or hurt them, but as a defensive mechanism. Because the... You help me find him? No. But you being here gives me the impression I'm going in the right direction. Motherfucker. But, um... The idea that, like, it's not so much that it's trying to trick anyone in particular, so much as, like, if I make myself look like someone that the host of this house loves, not again. Is there a wall to... I'm ignoring you. I'm ignoring you. No, you're behind a wall. Sorry. Oh yeah. By the way, that's right, boys. <laughs> but um, yeah. It, it's not so much that they're like trying to particularly trick, trick someone, so much as like. Actually, wait. That might be it. Let's hope it isn't. So much as if I look. If I look like someone that they love they'll be less likely to try to drive me out because they'll want to keep me around. It's that kind of defensive mechanism. Not so much, um... Did I go one too far? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where am I? Where am I? If I go down... I don't think this gets me anywhere. No, this doesn't get me. It'd be creepy seeing her like ready to jump off a cliff or something. Oh, that crying is kind of everywhere. And by everywhere, I mean right there. Gonna send, gonna send your soul back to hell, child. All right. Um, that might actually be where we need to go. Now that I look at it, um, hold on a sec. So it's not that one. Oh, no, 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 no. It's, um, wait, hold on. It... Okay, is it this one? Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, this one. Thought I saw something. Yeah, that's like, you know, you'll be less likely to get rid of me. And they have, like, just enough memory. You know, like that. No, I haven't, asshole. Bugger off, please. 
Oh, I ain't bugger enough. I'm killing you now. Fuck. Who could have saw this coming? But, um, they have, like, just enough memories from, like, the surroundings or, like, that they're able to, like, create their facsimile of or da da da. That, like, yeah, this room. That, like, they can kind of pass off as them. This is an interesting idea. I remember seeing one that was kind of similar in Doctor Who, except it wasn't played out to the full extent. Okay, we got we gotta find a way to like look inside of this thing. Cause I'm like 90% sure this is it. Isn't that it? Is that it? I genuinely thought this is it. Shit. Um It's not this one. It's not this one. Where the fuck is it? Hold on. Oh, hold on. I'm gonna turn around. I thought there's like a hole or something I could peek through. But um, the similar idea in Doctor Who was basically Cybermen coming from another dimension. And um, their goal is, for those of you who don't know, Cybermen are basically like uh, the brains of humans being used as a central processor for a computer. And they, you know, they see themselves as like the perfect beings. So they try to like, no grabby hands or anything. So they try to like, um, take other people's brains so that they can have more Simon. And, um... <sighs> it was like an invasion of London, or, like, maybe it was the world, I forget. So, um, the only thing everyone saw was these weird, faint, like, outlines. And everyone's like, oh my goodness, they must be ghosts. Oh, and, like, they're particularly following me around. And there was, like, some reason, I forget why, but with the technology that the Simon were using, because they're from a different dimension, that, um... Whatever you thought like that hand there whatever you thought the ghost was um it would start to take the certain aspects of so someone would be like oh my goodness this must be my dead grandpa and then it's like oh well, what's your grandpa like it's like oh he um he always worked with wood and he always smoked cigars like he always worked with wood and he always smoked cigars and he um I don't know. He loved playing violin. You know, in insert whatever details, right? The details are relevant. Oh, is, is a child at my feet? Bitch. You know, insert whatever details. And then, like... Oh. Mommy, sorry. Daddy was trying to get my ball and fell. It was scary. Oh, That's unfortunate. Now, now I'm the asshole. But, um... When, when the ghost would get near them because it was like a kind of facsimile of their own memories they would start to like yeah when he's nearby i i i i i smell um you know, what what are the okay, let's try those stairs over there you know like when when they're nearby i start to smell what did i say uh cigars and um cigars and woodwork like the smells of someone working with wood and um Oh, yo, uh, the sounds of a violin, I can hear them faintly, and they, they must be him. So it, like, fed into it, and that was, like, their defense mechanism until they could figure out how to, like, fully get through. And then once they fully got through, everyone was like, oh, yeah, Grandpa's joining us at the table. Isn't that great? And then Simon would just grab him by the arm and, like, take him out to the facility and rip their brain out with a chainsaw and shove it in a suit, and there'd be another Simon to join them. It is basically what it was. But it was just an interesting concept, which is why I bring it up of like a defense mechanism not designed to do any kind of damage or any kind of um yeah it's not designed to do damage or to like frighten your opponents it's designed to endear your opponents kind of like um how certain creatures use pheromones 
not as a way to like scare overload senses but as a way to make like oh this thing's you know this insert whatever smells nice so i want to keep it like that kind of a thing where the fuck am i going where the fuck am i going i thought for sure it'd be a sick corner was there another one in the partition room Let's try to let's try to get there. Yeah, we're like we're not we're not too far away from there. Let's 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 try to go there. I gotta turn around again. Okay, perfect. Right. Curse you fix camera angles for making me check the map twenty four seven. Curse you game for not having Modern sensibilities being on the PlayStation 2 and all, and not letting me instantaneously open the map. How could you do this to me? How could you not be a modern video game? If I can do this, that's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, shook at Yonis. I fought the one little ghost girl. And thought that this wasn't the path. And already, just from that sound, we can tell this is so the path. This is what we want. There we are. There we are. I like that I can look up and down. Sup, binge? Give me that picture. Give me that sweet, sweet picture. Oh no. I can't move. Guess where this hammer's going? Oh! No, come on. Now, unfortunately. Okay, so we need to get back down. And then we need to go. Yeah, we gotta go all the way north. A little bit of a trek. <sighs> Jeez. A little bit of a trek, but we can do it. Nothing the game's done. I'm just personally tired. But that's okay. Nice chill stream, right? Maybe these beautiful sounds of me working through. Did I just take the wrong turn? You know, maybe these, the beautiful sounds of me working my way through a haunted mansion that seals you in your dreams. Maybe they'll relax someone else. Maybe I'll help their, maybe I'll help them sleep. Or it'll get ten times worse. I hear the sounds. Or it'll get ten times worse and you will all live to regret it. And by live, I mean you won't live. On account of y'all being ghosts. Okay, um. Because this is taking me to south. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so we gotta hop down the stairs and go around. Time's up, bitch boy. Fuck! Whoa! Holy shit! You got fucking wraiths? Got dive bombers? Oh shit! Um. There. Gotcha. Come a little closer. Shit! I 
I was sitting here. Oh shit. Nice. Oh, she's good. <laughs> you seem nice. Oh. Oh. Shit. That's a miss. Oh, I got lucky. Okay, get a quick hit in. Oh, oh, there you are. There you go. All right, back up. What was that? Was that the wife, or was that like a corrupted version of the wife? Okay. I said this before and I'll say it again. I am loving how the ghosts are getting upgrades compared to the last game. They're faster, they move around more, but the, it's okay because you move around more. You're faster too. It's like it's like the um I was having a conversation with some with some people about this today that like um comparing Elden Ring to Dark Souls 1, 2 and 3 and it's that while there may be like individual weapons or individual places or bosses that you like better in each one um it's it's pretty much impossible to deny how each dark souls game is just an overall improvement in terms of like base gameplay it's the same thing from fatal frame one two and three that the controls are getting tighter you're getting faster Burp, so enemies are getting faster sure See the way she moved? It was almost like a fish. I loved it. Now let's uh let's let's, let's invest. Uh... Wow, I hate it. So if I take pictures of all this, all the doors will unlock, right? Wow, this sucks. This is awful. Take that little girl! For a second, I thought she wasn't leaving. I was gonna say shit. On the candlelit altar is a huge gemstone as big as my palm. It looks like it might be used in some kind of ceremony. Yoink. Something is reflecting light above the altar. Ah, oh, God. I don't remember seeing Bellflower. I don't remember seeing Bellflower anywhere. I saw Dance something. Oh, let's talk about this little girl. Let's talk about this. Woo! Wow, I got lucky. Little girl had a stake and a hammer. Get, oh, I, oh, I, almost, I almost got the three fur. I almost got the three fur. Little girl has a, and she moves. I'm out of ammo. Oh. I didn't think I was out of ammo. Oh god. Okay. Oh no 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 no! She's smiling. You get out of that altar, young lady. You get out of that altar. Shit! Yeah, that's right. Yeah, move in. Move in. Get that double. Almost got that triple. I don't even know. I, I know I have specials, but I don't even know how to use them. That's not it. There's triangle. Are you hurt? Whoa! Not my feet! Oh shit. Uh. Shit! Get the fuck away from my feet. My tootsies. Oh. Damn. What, do I need to like... That's ex- Oh my goodness! 
I can't believe it. Hold on. Ah, damn it. Maybe it isn't. Maybe, maybe it isn't. Bit. Okay, hold on. I'm not looking at you. It so is. It so is. This film isn't doing anywhere near as much damage as before. So I must have put in the shitty film. Yeah, she knows to dodge the camera. So I need to specifically wait until she starts swinging and then go in. Oh my goodness. This is, this is, this ghost is on another level. Of course, it's a little girl trying to just stake me to the wall. Yeah, she knows to avoid. She knows. Oh yeah, bitch. How about that? Yeah, how about that? I don't know how to use specials, so... Ooh, shit. I think she does it sometimes randomly, too, but, um... She re... She really seems to be... Doing her best to avoid me. Get that charge. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. Hey, 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 I'm getting just about nowhere with her. Okay. Stop that shit. Meanwhile, what I don't realize is little girl's actually like immortal. Damn. Yeah, that's why I don't realize this little girl's this little girl's actually like immortal. And this is the final boss fight. I'm about to get the. I'm about to get the secret ending for like. Boom. Anyways, I'm gonna. I wonder if being impaled hurts. I wonder which hurts worse, having the stake going a little bit at a time or having it stabbed through all at once. I wonder if they did die, if they die if the stake goes all the way through. I wonder if it matters if they die. I want to impale a real priestess soon. Hello. Ah, uh, my tattoo getting bigger. Ooh, it's starting to come in well. The oh god, I got musty film. Oh god, that that was freaky. That uh, that was that was freaky. And honestly, a pretty hard boss fight. But uh, yeah, I think so. How's it going, man? Okay, hold on. Let's see. Let's see if we can upgrade the camera. Uh, we got twenty thousand points to our name, and the thing I want is at forty thousand. So that's okay. We're 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 about halfway there. Um, I'm gonna look at the files I have real quick, just to see like, um, notes. Um. Yeah, camera obscura. Okay, hold on. Uh, no, this is this is actual notes. I want to look for tutorial notes. F fuck it, I guess. Fuck it, I guess. I guess we don't. I don't, I, I guess we don't need slow. <laughs> Figure it's better than nothing. Just having it doesn't mean I have to upgrade it. But yeah, I think we just beat night. 
or hour three. I don't know how many hours there are in this game total. But let's go let's go talk to my gal pal and develop some film. Why are we going into a cutscene? Sorry, death pop, pop. <laughs> Just pop. Alright, there we go. Creepy ass song. Look, I told you when I hire you. First things first. No creepy ass songs. No creepy ass songs. Alright. That's a big thing. Miku, that song. Oh, Ray, good morning, that song. I don't remember exactly where I heard it, but I feel like I've been hearing it in my dreams lately. I don't have any idea what the lyrics mean. Besides sleep, priestess sleep, and my last experience with priestesses didn't go so well because it involved ropes. Could it be some sort of dialect? Dreams. Great. I start to feel homesick, like I'm remembering someone important. At the end of the dream, I'm so scared, all I can remember is that I'm very afraid. But that's just the way dreams are, I guess. No. No. That's not how dreams... No. I'm eating breakfast. I'm eating breakfast. Okay, I guess I can't eat breakfast. Never mind. I'm going to go play in my red room. Never mind, I'm reading a letter. Your rent is overdue. Dear you, I'm sending you a testimony tape I just found about the urban legend. If I give it to you, I know you'll take good care of it. What? I found several of the tapes, as they're quite old, have been dubbed by a gramophone, they're damaged. I'm trying to get them restored now. I'll send them to you when they're done. Lately, I've solely been researching folklore, legends, folk tales, and folk religion. That was well, you and Mafia's field, wasn't it? It's an interesting world, but I don't want to get too deep into it. How's M Mafia's sister? Her name is Miku, right? I'm searching everywhere I can, but I still don't know Junsei Takamine's whereabouts. Maybe he was spirited away too? If you got anything, let me know. Mio's health is not... Oh no. Mio's health is not good, so I put her in the hospital. She only wakes once every two days, and then for only a couple hours of time, I've got to hurry with my research. Yep, that's Fatal Frame 2. Yep. Yep, that's me. That's me. That's me. I'm gonna go play that on the tape. I'm gonna go play that tape deck in my room. Hang on, I gotta go get some shit. No, I gotta go get some shit developed. We gotta go get my shit developed, and then we gotta go on Ghost Patrol. But I guess we're doing Ghost Patrol a little early. Guess I didn't do anything with my day either. I figure I... Guess I, um... I never stopped fucking... Where do we live? Seattle? Shit. Hold on. Oh. You're in here with the cat. Hey. Ray, what's the matter? Miku, that person in the picture on your desk. Yeah, that was my dead brother from the first game. He decided to go hang out with the rope priestess. Shit's crazy. Uh, I'm trying to... I don't like these smell straw. This is how I read before bed, sitting up. Outside of my blankets. Can I talk to you? Alright, fine. I'm out, I'm, out, I'm out of sugar water. Alright, hold on. Can I, can I talk to you a little bit? Can I talk to the cat? Can I... Alright. Um, listen, I know I didn't... Oh. 
Mighty Patrol Mighty Patrol Everything's going okay On Mighty Patrol Nothing will matter On Mighty Patrol The fuck is that? The fuck is that? Nothing will matter. Mighty patrol. Did anyone else see those legs? Alright, um. I don't have a reason not to obscure this or de uh, develop this. Uh. Um, I'm worried about this little girl. She's nasty. She's smiling. Who or what could she be? I don't know, but she's a fucking creep. There's... But no, the ghosts are so in our house. Like, I've been saying Night Patrol as a joke because nothing's happened. But shit is happening. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Cat. The cat. The cat. The cat. Let me examine the cat, damn you. But yeah, that those legs being there. Yep. Those legs being there. And then the moment I like take my camera out or change angle. I bet like when I was up here and it was like starting to get like a little filmy. I bet if I took my camera out I could have saw something like down there. That would have been really good. Renee? Are you having trouble sleeping? Is that the is that the emulator? Ready. This is it. Is is this is that the emulator or is that the game? Here you go, Ray. I thought this might have some connection have connection to that photo of the passageway. No, oh, thank you. It's been poor than a process of rebuilding Kukaiji Temple, which commenced last month. Many, many, many monuments have been found in the walls of the hallway. That's weird. In the, wall, in the walls of the area called the Shadow Hallway in Kukaiji Temple. Okay, so we found the temple. There were stains in the shape of humans. But when that hallway was restored, someone noticed that there was something like the root of a tree coming out of the wall. Digging out, it turned out to be a mummy. Gross. In the other stained areas, many more mummies were found in quite a commotious race. The Kukai Temple insists that they are enshrined saints, but certain observers argue that they may have been killed in sacrifice. Good. Oh, thank you. On the 8th in a survey of an, ancient uh, of an ancient castle ruins in the northern part of the prefecture, a large number of human bones were discovered in the ground. Sack tombs were excavated from the center of the castle, an area thought to be the courtyard. Bone after bone was discovered beneath them. All bones are thought to be from the time the castle was built. The burial clothes seem to indicate that they are from laborers who built the castle. It is believed they were buried after the castle's completion to protect the plan of the castle location of treasure. But in fact, that's ac that actually happened a lot. Like they would kill the architects and the nice. workers. Agreed. It is believed that they were buried after the castle completion to protect the plan of the castle and the location of treasure. Perhaps those who built the sacrifice were killed in a sacrifice. Man, research that abandoned house. Man, you're just giving me all sorts of great shit here. Uh, all right. Uh, below is a summary of what about of what a newspaper patrol told me about the coverage of the abandoned house. I didn't have time before, so please take this as a reference. Okay. They say that there were several villages around the manor until the 1900s, but today only the abandoned house remains. Even the landlord does not know when or why it was built. Not only the area... Let's see. <laughs> yeah, having, <laughs> having trouble sleeping here. Read all this nightmare fuel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this will put you right to sleep. <laughs> yeah, I'm great dreams. 
But today only the abandoned house remains. Even the landowner does not know when or why it was built. Now only the area around the entrance is left, but originally it was a huge manor, deep and strangely shaped. It seems on old maps a shrine is occasionally drawn in, but now there exists not such as a tra not much of as a trace of it, and not much is known about it. But on the outlying mountains, it seems a myth like a myth like story is told that is connected to the other world. The dead you meet will summon you to the other world, you say? The rumor's origins are said to be in, seon in seances that are held in a shrine there, but that's merely a rumor too. In any case, I think the story of the mountain connected to the other world is the source of the rumor. <sighs> you can ask me whatever you want, okay? Why is your voice glitching? Hey, have some photos. Hey, have some... It seems like you're having a lot of Here, have, have, have more work. Are you alright? Have more... I, I... What can I do for you? Uh, yeah, if you could research this photograph for me. Understood. I'll let you know if I find anything. And this photograph. It's raining again. And this photograph. It's raining again. It's raining again. It's raining again. I say eventually I talk to her and it's just like dial-up tones. It's just like, it's raining again. <laughs> I glitched out for a second too, and that just fit perfectly. I don't know why my camera does that. Like I could check, like unplug and replug it real quick, but actually, hold on. We I got a tape deck, so it's all audio. In my dream, I saw a my mother. Silent Hill. In that Inside, there was an old shrine. It was cold. Mary Blythe says. Snow was falling. I could hear a song. In that, there in that so town. Many people going into the shrine. It, it was like that. It's done it since you got it. Yeah. Procession. I'll let it slide because it's fun. Everyone was hiding their faces. My mother was among them. No like matter how many times races. I called her, she kept going further and further. I wonder if there's like an ending that if you like inspect your house too much or like listen to too many of these like these records or like and stuff like that, you get shut. consumed by the ghost just because you listen to too it's much like of it. I was going to be left all because there's alone. always an option to stop. I saw it every day. Someone's gonna be like, don't listen to this tape! If you listen to it, you can end. I wouldn't be able to come back. But. I thought I could meet my mother in there. Man, I'm gonna have such a good night's sleep tonight. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna sleep like a baby. Like just an absolute. Baby. My mother, she just kept smoking further and further, and I couldn't follow through a cloud of smog she left, and I was left all alone. If I could only target the fumes, I could meet my mother in there. <laughs> ah, her vape cloud. Her vape cloud was just too strong. I couldn't survive the watermelon, the strawberry. It was just too much. I said, smoke cigarettes. Smoke a real cigarette, Mom. Even a cigar or a pipe. And she said, no, I'm embracing the vape. <laughs> and I was like, no, mother, no. And she's like, I like doing the because it makes the big fumes go everywhere. And I'm like, no, mother, no. Anyway, so that vape pen cost her $3,000. <laughs> Wait, what was that? Not this, not this shit again. Dream again. Oh. Oh shit. Here we go again. Oh fuck. Anymore. Oh fuck. Hour four. The evil dream. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, thick rope. That's going to bring back good memories. Alright, so here's the first question.
Do we have... No! We do not have the camera obscura. Worst... I think this is the mansion from the first game. This is the mansion from the first game! Right, the first game was the one that had the, uh, the, uh, the mask that had to shift and all the ropes and... Oh... The mirror... Is this? S! Now here's the question. Let's see how cool this game is. Let's see if this game's cool or not. The camera is different. Right, I'm gonna get one level into range. I feel like that's a good idea. Oh, oh, we're back. We're back. See, on one side, I could get mad about this, and I could be like, they're just ripping off the original. Oh, I remember these. Oh, you know, they're just ripping off the original and doing reused material or whatever, right? Like, I, I could get mad about that. But this is creepy. And for her purposes... Oh, there it is. For her purposes, it makes sense. Especially if whatever this creature is, like, uses dreams and memories against you. Yep. Yep. Alright, let me guess. Yep. Hmm. Engraving the pestle is the same number of panes as are engraved on the sleeping stone. I, I need a... Uh. Oh! <gasps> Shit! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! Fast boy, motherfucker. Oh wait, that's that's not that's not right. Oh shit! Just rocked me. Go oh, I missed. That's okay, cause you missed too. All right, runner. Bagoo, bitch. Maybe this isn't a good place to fight. Yeah, that's right. Oh, shit! No, oh, back up. Oh. Yeah, because the circle's so much smaller, I have to really aim. Miku Hinasaka special ability. Effect 1. By pressing the blank button using the sacred stone, you slow the moon of a ghost. Since the ghost moves more slowly, it's easier to dodge attacks or aim in the shutter chance or fatal frame. You cannot use the sacred stone if the sacred stone mirror drops to zero. If Miku damages a ghost or receives damage, the sacred stone mirror replenishes. Higher level of the fight. Uh... That's pretty cool. I like that. I like it because you don't have to aim to use it. You don't have to aim to use it. You could just kind of, you could just kind of pop that shit. What just? What? What? 
What? The... What? 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 What just happened? Yeah, this I remember. Yep. And it goes to the anger. And now we can... Uh, no. It was not... No, it was... It was... Um... No. No. Uh-uh. We got fast girl. We got fast girl. Oh, God. That's right, bitch. We got fast girl up in here. Whoop. Hi. Um, I hit. I hit you. Holy shit. Shit, um, I'm pretty sure I hit you. Um, I need health. And we gotta... Uh, we, we, uh, wait, hold on. It's time for the big boy. There you are. <gasps> I miss. That's right. Get wrecked. I sh I should have. I should have shot. Oh oh oh! We got a target. Yeah, I can take that. Yeah, take that as well. Oh shit. Okay, a little late. Ooh, yeah. Boom. That's nice. It's Pennywise's wife. Um, Sanskrit. Uh, I remember it count. It's it, 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 it's clockwise and it counts. The oh. Oh, Max, come on, come on. You got better at these, right? What do you mean you didn't get better at these? You got better at these, right? Oh shit, I fucked up. Mm. Oh, I, I, ah, th these things kicked my butt. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay, um... Yeah, there. Uh, and and then um here, and then here. Okay. Oh. What's up, child? I need the money. So, um... How did it say I get power for my slow again? It's like when I take damage and when I kill ghosts, or... But no, I don't remember the rooms being laid out like that. Am I, am I misremembering? Oh, I remember this shit! Yeah, it's like, it's like it's not the correct layout, it's just scrunched together kind of a thing. Oh, I got some bad memories here. Oh, it's the same style! It's the same cutscenes! I don't even know if they improved them. They just looked, oh, I love it! Oh shit. 
Oh shit. Don't touch it, it's a ghost. Don't touch it, it's a ghost. What are you doing? Don't, I don't, 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 no, no, no. Me! My hand! A third hand grows out! I'm behind you now, me! Woo! That's way creepier! Ass, whoa! It's got long ass arms! Holy shit, it's got long ass arms! Oh, oh shit. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that's right. Look at its long ass arms. Ooh, it's a long range fighter too. The stand can work at about 10 meters, it seems. Probably longer. Yeah, that's right, Binch. You big scary motherfucker. You also seem to like moving in. Oh shit. Oh shit! You also, you also seem to like moving in straight lines. Let's go to the gates of hell. I don't know if they want us to go to this gates of hell or if they want us to exit. I don't want to go. Got my brothers in there. It probably is actually meant to be the uh, front door, which I mean, it's not, it, it's a it's a straight path. So, you know, it's not like it's hard to get to. But if I had to make a bet, if I was a betting man, we're gonna escape this place and they're gonna poop us right into the sleeping manor. That's it, I'm busted in. That's it, I'm busted in. What's good, child? What's good? No. Snow is falling. It's a quiet night. This could be the last snow in the 10 years of changing seasons I have watched from this window. As I watch the snow, I get the feeling that something has passed. Finally, I've severed all of my attachments. I'll give my body over to the ropes and seal the gates. She then proceeded to not because she loved someone. The bastard! How dare she fall in love with someone? What a, what a prick! Like what a selfish prick that she fell in love and wanted to make a friend and wanted to live her life instead of being in a cage and being ripped apart by ro ropes. Like, honestly, how could you be so selfish? Like just and the red dripping. It's dripping red. That definitely wasn't a graphical error. That was for real. Thank you, Angry Mask. Just gonna once again point out that that was for sure definitely not how that was in the original, but that's okay because that's just the situation we're in. And now I leave. I'm... No, I'm not going that way! Okay, hello. That is how it's pronounced, right? It's gonna have you here. I'm gonna save state and then try to leave. We're gonna see what happens. <laughs> Heck no, we ain't doing that. <laughs> yeah, how's it going? Creepy ghost lady wants us to go investigate something that'll kill us. That sounds like more fun. Yeah, I know there's I know there's some kind of goodie over here. Nice. Hey. Right. You might call me a cheater for using save states, but I don't have a good reason. Okay, so you wanted me to go this way. You wanted me to go this way, small child. Oh god, this is such a bad idea. 
This is such a horrible idea. Oh, this is gonna go so poorly. Oh, this is how you get the bad ending. This is how you get the possessed ending. Or some shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, I hate this. Why am I doing this? Oh, I was chased here a lot. I'm gonna loot your shit. What's her face is gonna wake me up and be like, You've been asleep for three weeks? What the fuck? No one cooks or cleans here except for you! I literally can't take care of myself! Be like, Oh my goodness, you can do the dishes like once. Shit. Leave me alone. Like, you know, I might be your assistant, but fuck. Um. Wait a second. Now it's connected. Oh no. Yeah, how's it going? It's connected. Only a man can move it. So that's the second thing we need a man for. <gasps> Where's that one hallway that we need to crawl through? That's the first place we should go. It's a great idea. What? Ah, shit. Ah. Ah, okay. All right. All right. Okay. Hold on. First, I gotta get a timer. Hold on. First, 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 I gotta get a timer. Oh, I just realized it. Redris, you specifically did this because you knew- Redris, I s- Okay. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for being here. Um, I'm not sure what VGMH is, but thank you all so much for coming. You are all going to witness something that I only ever do as a joke because Redris decided to pop it right when you guys got here. Hello. Uh, we're going to turn the microphone real, uh, real sensitive for a second. Um, there we go. Normally, I don't do this, but... Look, veterans Gaming and Mental Health Mission... Oh! Well, it's so good to have you! Thank the cherry flavor! Thank you so much for following! I really appreciate it! But, um... I'm Jerry! It's some army puppet! I'll be nice and I'll put on a little bit longer of an ASMR than before. Because... Redrus happened to... Redris happened to do a viewer prize, and now this is just what we are going to do. My ASMR voice sucks at! Anyway. Oh. Lexus Closet, thank you so much for following me, and I greatly appreciate it. I have no idea what this accent is. Let me just kiss the microphone real quick. I only ever do this as a bit, but we are going to let it slide for this time. I swear, I, I swear, I swear to goodness, if you uwu me, I am going to turn this fucking bus around. Anyways, welcome back to the Fatal Frame 3 Tormented Stream. Hello? Child, I would like you to please leave the premises as I'm trying to go into my boss's mind prison right now. Makes that. <laughs> Makes that cop, sir. Cop, sir. Um, so, I've turned the bus around, it's going back. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> um, so, I'm j real, um, real, real, real quick, just as like a general reference, if it's like too sensitive or if it doesn't sound right, say the word, we can, we can fiddle with it. Yeah, if, if the ASMR experience isn't quite to your liking. Oh. Thank you, child in a box. I greatly appreciate what you're trying. And now we are officially back home. I was dreaming someone else's dream. Listen to, just. I'm gonna be very impressed if that has, if that has any form of actual sound that can be processed. <laughs> 
Was that Miku's dream? But why? It seems Miku is having that same dream too. Also that we share a dream present! <laughs> Damn. Uh, we don't need to, we don't need to save now. We have the glory. We have the glory of save states. We must now do our. If anyone has played Silent Hill for the room, except we're not in our ninety, we need to do our patrol. It will begin first and foremost by finding my employee that does everything in the. <laughs> that does everything in the house. And we will go consult her. This is wrong. Oh god, maybe she's so maybe she is sleeping. Listen to the sound of the hardwood. As it creaks and shit, there's a nail. Fuck ass stupid thing. I swear to goodness if I find a ghost sitting above okay, never mind. Miku? Nope. Ray. Did you I'm sorry. Did you have a dream about being choked by ropes again, but not in like the way that you want to be, but in like a genuinely painful way? Oh, Ray, I don't feel so well today. I didn't sleep so well. Miku, did something happen yesterday? I just had a strange dream, that's all. Please don't worry about me. By the way, a letter came for you this morning. I left it in the kitchen. Thanks, get- I've totally lost track of who's who. Thanks, get some rest today. Oh, and there's this. Do work for- oh, wait, no. K. Amakura, isn't this him? Where did you find this photo? Yesterday, looking through my brother's albums. My brother worked on the same editing team as you for... Uh, as you... For me... I thought there might be a photo of him left over from those days. I see. Thank you. On the back of the photo is written, K. Amakura, recent photo of author. He a handsome son of a bitch. Any, anyways, I got photos for you. Do, do you have more research for me? You've been through some shit, but like, are you still co you're still coming into work? Okay. <laughs> if you remix my if you remix my voice into a song, I'll get real embarrassed real quickly. It is very easy to embarrass me. Uh. No. Thanks so much. Thank you so much for. Thank you so much for stopping by, Cherry. It's good to have you here, and thank you again for the follow. Oh, that's my beautiful cat. I will now pet the cat. No, let me examine. Let me examine the. Let let me bother the cat. I I want to. I want to bother the cat. I desire to bother the cat as it is drinking baked beans. Anyways, let's read this letter. No. That's very kind of you. Are you talking about her? Well, never mind. It looks like it's from K. Miku must have brought it in and left it here. Have you listened to the three tapes that three uh, I sent before? I'd like you to listen to them before you read the rest. Nope. Maybe you won't believe it, but I've had the manner of str- <sighs> First, I thought I was just thinking about the manner too much, but after listening to those tapes into Mio, I'm displaying the same symptoms. In the dream, how do you write a letter and ask some I'm in a snowy manner. I don't remember it well, but it resembles the house I got the camera obscura from. I got a bad sense for the manor, just like the testimonies. The only difference is I was pursuing Mio in the manor, and Mio wasn't dead. Was it me or was it me or am I? Which one's the very small curse? <laughs> The fuck's going on in my chat? The only difference is I, if the urban legend of the manner of sleep is true and I can wake Mio from her dream, maybe I can save her. Even if it makes little sense, I feel I'm getting closer to the truth. Three cassettes. Maybe they're in use room somewhere. Oh, don't take me. Don't take me away. Don't, ah. Welcome everyone. As we are back in our house and it's still fucking raining. Welcome back to Nighty Patrol. First, we shall check on our assistant. Make sure she's doing all right. Hey, you doing all right? I really can't, I really, I really. I'm pretty sure that's emulator, but it's my head cannon that it's actually the ghost eating her brain right now. 
But we're not going to acknowledge that because we're playing on a completely legitimate and real PlayStation 2. This is my controller. As you can see, it's totally real. I swear to goodness, if on my patrol I find any ghost bitches inside of here, I will throw something. Nope, nothing in here. Uh, nope. Nope. Oh. In the Oh. Lovely. The camera obscura is a device used to capture the other world made by a cultist Kunihiku Asu from the late 19th to the early 20th century. He tried to communicate with and get proof of this other world. The term occultist refers to people involved in the movement to verify Eastern thought using contemporary Western technology. Kunihiku Asu is a prime example of such an occultist. I don't think that's actually... The camera obscura was one of his quintessential experiments. He modified the at the time still rare camera by adding a special lens in film. It was supposed to capture unbelievable things normally invisible to the naked. It's actually just... That's all good. It's actually just a kaleidoscope, but like he doesn't want to tell anyone. Normally invisible to the naked eye. Like a so-called different phase interval in spirits and ghosts. The, the, they are very rare nowadays, but apparently these cameras are still traded among curio dealers. Most have been broken, and we have lost a chance to see the other world, as well as Asu's achievements for eternity. No, 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 no blueprints. No, no. Yep. The, the device shown here was shown here was left by Kunihiko Asu. He used it to substantiate the existence of and communication with the spirit world. He was a brilliant scientist and philosopher, and if you subscribe to his page, and by appropriating Western culture in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, he combined new technology with his theory on the spirit world to prove its existence. Also, like the four towns, separate towns we've seen, that all have portals to hell. It's a little weird of a bit of a coincidence. And instead of the few devices, we're able to capture an unbelievable existence from the spirit realm. But posthumously, from that singular beginning, his devices became a fashion item among dilettantes. Dil 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 dilettant dil dil and were scattered about the country. One such device is this projector. Having completed the experimental stage of the camera obscura, camera that photographs the outer the world's above, he created a screen upon which to project the special images captured on the film. Oh, the records say the images were projected that they could not be seen when they were photographed. That could be really bad. Um. Uh. Many of the urban. Oh God, it's eleven. Okay, my timer ran out, but like, I'll just finish the ASMR. Many of the urban legends classified as Lost Village are modeled on real incidents, such as a village was ruined when the one villager massacred the others. Ah! They are often an amalgamation of well-known actual incidents, legends, and oral tradition. Settings such as the isolated mountain village, ah! or bygone customs like night trysts or ceremonies often act to trigger the incidents themselves, and these in turn become the motive for urban legends. The reason for the popularity of urban legends may lie in the notion of the view of the country from the city of the modern bias towards the ancient. To people in the modern city, the village is the wilderness, and those who live there are different. Perhaps that scorn or fear finds expression in the urban legend. For that reason, the setting of the legend must be the isolated mountain village. Further, bygone cost, uh, cut, 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 customs cut, 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 are attractive elements that end up acting to provoke the acting to provoke the. Shush. As a case in point, there is a story about the area around the Minakami Dam where Mayu went miss. The lost village. In the mountains of the Minakami area, there once was, there was once a massacre in the so-called Lost Village. Years ago, on the night of a certain festival, there was a great massacre, and the village disappeared from the map. Only one woman survived. A giggling young girl with a knife who got real stab happy with it, all things considered. If you walk in the forest where the village once lay, there is a small guardian statue, and if you continue, you will come to the shrine gate that forms the entrance to the village. Your ass will also get locked there. There is no getting out of that shit. If you should pass through the gate, you will never return. The night of the massacre continues in this village where day will never again break, and a woman's horrific laugh rings throughout the village. Next, we have the manner of bizarre murders where the same tragedy occurred. Not really that good of a title, honestly. We're still kind of workshopping it a little bit. Doesn't really roll off the tongue like we like it to. Its scale is smaller, but generally speaking, it resembles the pattern of the village as it is made up of elements based on true incidents. Below is an example of this. It has to do with Mafuyu's dis- <gasps> The house of mutilation. In the mountain area of Himuro, there remains a manor where years ago there was said to be a massacre. 
What's all these fucking massacres happening? There have always been vanishings in the nearby forest, and many of the spirited away are said to end up in the manor. Their corpses have been found with both hands, legs, and heads severed. Uh, correction, they were torn off. They were torn off with ropes. The best ropes. Uh, one more example is a seemingly related manner of sleep urban legend that I'm researching now. The manner of sleep legend is picked up in various magazines in the 1960s, where incidents were very similar characteristics with, with very similar characteristics can be found here and there in older media. This newspaper is from early 1900s and is of no relation to when the manner of sleep legend was taken up, but the background of the spirited aways and those people later conditions spread many similarities to the manner of sleep urban legend. I'm still investigating, but these incidents may trace back to the 19th century, and I have seen legends in several folklore that, in the books that may have become the basis for the manner of sleep. Perhaps this is what Kay was asked to investigate. You had a well-organized notebook on urban legends to your file. Oh god, there's more. Series of vanishing. So, y'all, I hope y'all enjoy this lore dump, because I'm stuck in ASMR mode until it ends. <gasps> According to sources, before dawn yesterday, a mother and daughter who live in Myojin village went missing. The missing are Maki Kusahara and her daughter Kazu. Since last year, the two have been searching for Kusahara's missing husband. The two reportedly wandered the mountains nearly every day. The informant says, I hadn't seen them for several days, so I went to visit them. There was no answer, so I went inside, but they were gone. I only saw some black soot-like marks. Similar disappearances are being recorded across the area, and some are calling them spirited aways. It's a pretty. It's a pretty good movie. It's, it's pretty, pretty good. I got a tape on the manner of sleep of a legend from a source at the hospital. A psychiatrist had recorded the medical condition of a patient. There's a lot of background noises. It was originally recorded on a gramophone, but the content is great. A plus. I rated it five stars on on Spotify. It's not quite anthropology, but I think you'll be interested too. It's a lot to ask, but I'd like you to find out about legends of cases of missing persons similar to this one. Uh. Nice. Oh my god. Is there anything else? That took forever. I'm so gonna get fuck. I'm so gonna get fucking possessed. Alright, and there we go. Now I can talk normal again. Hello! And once again, I just want to thank everyone, as Redris got lucky with when he popped that um ASMR thing. But thank you all so much for watching it. Or, you know, I really hope everyone's enjoying this. And thank you for the raid again. I, I don't know if, um, I don't know if Carrie Jane's still here. But thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much. I, I hope everyone's enjoying this. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I need to give another letter to, to What's-Her-Face, my lovely assistant, whose name I don't remember. Because I'm horrible with Japanese names. Nope. It's raining again. Yeah, sure. All right, fine, whatever. All right, we're going back on Nighty Patrol. Because last time we saw some feetsies, and I don't appreciate it. It's my fucking house. It's my house, and if you ain't paying rent, why are you here? Okay, hold on. Where's the food? Uh... Like we're in a fragile place, damage easy if you wash the machine, she says. Man, where would I be without her? Probably dead. Probably possessed. All right, where's the cat? Where's the cat? Where's the cat? Where's the spooks? Wait, what? I can see my face reflecting in the mirror above the wash basin. I think she said maybe I've lost a little bit of weight again, so I'm guessing that means she's just straight up. Oh, there's the cat. There's the cat. Oh no 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 no! We got we got we got to we got to take a picture of the cat. I don't care how much how much photos or how. <gasps> Pet the cat. No response. Just like a real cat. All right, as part of Nighty Patrol, we just gotta. We don't gotta do much. We just gotta we just gotta look around a little bit. Make sure the area is secure. All right, we're good. Um, I don't. Do do I have any? Do, do I do I have any, do I have any photos? To... Nope. Okay, never mind. All right, well that's the end of Ninety Patrol. On to the next hour, which, as I said, I don't know how many hours are in this game. 
you know, it strikes me, you know, if we go off Five Nights at Freddy's rules, there should be six. But, um... There might be eight. But what surprises me is that was, like, that was four. So, no way. Are we on five? Like, we're cruising right along. Heck, most of the time it's taken up with me insisting on Nighty Patrol. We probably don't even actually need to go on Nighty Patrol. But we do need to listen to is some lovely jams. Some lovely jambalams. Oop. Um, you already listened to this one, right? Yes, that dream. I dreamt at the manor. Yes. Yes, my name is Sarazawa. It's the same manor. It's a big and quiet manor. It's also designed like a maze, if I can find out why. It was snowing, and then the roof collapsed, and the snow started coming in. Um, a song? It sounds like some sort of a nursemaid song. The child kept stabbing at the doll. There's creepy as shit. When I came to, it always hurt. You're right here. It was always pain. Right here, right here. being stabbed like a doll. Can't you see it? Look, it's right here. It's true. It kept spreading. What was that sound that was just in my ear for a second? It sounded like someone said, cut. Huh? How many times do I have to explain it? It was a manor. And it was snowing. There was blood. Lots of people, they collapsed all over. In the hallway, in the room, everywhere. Sorry. He was a man so. in white clothes, but he had no face. Did he have a hatchet? There was a hatchet and blood on the walls. I always ran as hard as I could. So far. I'm sorry. Came out of the walls. I'm sorry that I have a hard time taking horror games seriously. The one chasing the man. That's right. That woman. Yesterday she touched me. I was kind of into it. Cold. Still kind of into it. Even when I woke up, my body was like ice. This tattoo looks pretty great, right? It's it's, it's it. You like? You like it? Want want it? Want it? No? Okay. Well, what's that little suitcase for? That's for my home defense pistol. I'm a big believer in the Second Amendment. All right, let's go. Here we go again. Back on the road. Oh, that's Silent Hill too. Right. <gasps> Hot damn! She looking fine over there. Hour five vanishing. Instructions for special action hide added to file. Can I like hide anywhere? Or do I gotta be like? Sorry, the, the fixed camera angles just screwed me up. Uh... Um. 
How many days has it been? How many months? How many years? Many outsiders have been brought here, but none of them are like him. He said my hair was beautiful, but no matter how much I arrange it, he'll probably never know how I feel. All I can do is comb my hair and wait for him. That way, when he comes back with his camera, he'll take my picture again. Ah, <laughs> camera! Okay, got it. Oh, that's hor- That's horrifying. Among the fragments I have for with Holly. Oh, that's creepy. So what, when like the music starts going into like dueling banjos, do I need to like find a place and hide? I don't even- I don't even know where I'm trying to go. Wait, wait, hold on. Is it- is it- is it, um... Is it, uh, this? Holly. I have no idea if this will actually work. The game has not told me that I have a camera obscura. So my first instinct is to assume that I can't fight. Fuck it, let's find out. Sup, bench? Oh, you're Holly. All right, well, let's follow her. I have no reason not to, right? Worst case scenario, I'd take her on in a fight. Bitch! Yeah, you ever think about that? Oh, this ain't a fighting camera. This ain't a fighting camera! Fuck! Well, shit. Time for my patent pentated jukes. Hold on. That's right, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, good luck getting through this. You don't know how that shit works. Mm -mm. I'm so damn stealthy, I don't even know where I'm going. That is how damn stealthy I am. Remember everyone, there's three kinds of stealth. First, the ones where you're act... First is the kind where you're actually stealthy. The second is the kind where if you just simply the fuck is that little house doing there? What in the world is that little house doing there? Can I go towards it? No. The second is the idea where if you move so fast, you can't be caught. And the third is Russian stealth, where you know there's no witnesses if you don't leave any witnesses. Uh, as a short, large person. <laughs> That's all good. Um, where am I trying to go? But nope, I'm I am a grown ass man. I'm just being sneaky, I guess. Uh oh shit. I'm just Oh, I gotta I gotta, I gotta go I gotta go around. Which means I'm gonna have to run through the, uh... Which means I'm gonna have to run through the one lady again. Because I don't have a concept of stealth. What did I jokingly call it once? It's like actual stealth versus, um... It's like actual stealth, Russian stealth, and French stealth. And I don't think that's even really accurate to say French, but it's just the idea of, like... Oh. Oh! Uh? Huh, okay, it's a palanquin. But, um... Yeah, there's no historical precedent to call it a French stealth, but just the idea of, like, if you move fast enough... Oop, oop. There, there you go. Dead ass. If you move fast enough, they can't catch you. 
and I don't have a combat related camera so we're just going to we're, we're just gonna we're just gonna act on moving fast enough do I even have a map Floating girl's here, and I already committed, so... Also, the imagery with the hair. Honestly, really creepy. Ah, damn it. Forgot about that. Okay, um... Let's try... Let's try back here, towards the, uh... Okay, and save. Now we know the tattoo girl is here. And we know if she touches us once, we're dead. Just guaranteed we're dead. All right, something good. Well, it's a start. All right, that's, that's, that's a fine start. Can't believe my freaking sister. Both my sisters are were so good at that. Just getting freaking trouble, getting lost. Carson's <gasps> Carson's a butterfly. Oh, I always forget which sister is which, though. It's snowing. It's snowing on Mount Fuji. It's interesting that you're going through this mansion's prior characters on top of the. Yeah, like, I mean, like I said before, on. Oh, is she coming towards me? I'm gonna put my booty right here. She won't notice me. She is totes gonna. She is totes gonna notice me. She is totes gonna notice me right there. She's like fucking coming all the way over. Good enough. Um, yeah, like on one side, I'm sitting here going like, man, this is a new character. Okay, there's one new character and one new location, but like they're reusing story things from one and two and burp, burp, burp. But it's also kind of fun. Seeing it all come together, you know what I mean? Like seeing them be connected. Like I've I've always stood by you don't have to have connected stories. You know, things could just be individual on their own. But like it's interesting. Man, she's taking her sweet ass time getting over here. Someone's gonna clip this for porn. Did she pass by me and I can't tell? Ass! Shit, she fast. No. Russian stealth is not an option and French stealth has failed us. We outie! We outie! Wait, what? Well, where else am I supposed to go? There's literally no other path. Well, I fucked up. And I've committed to my fate. I found you. No, you didn't. That's right, you didn't find shit. Get wrecked. Get fucking juked. <laughs> Get fucking juked. Okay, can't go this way. Gonna go the other way. Get fucking juke. Let's see you climb them stairs. Let's see you work that cardio. Bye. Alright, um, so where else can I go? Maybe maybe I go up maybe maybe I go up those stairs. We already went up those stairs, Max. Well, it's fucking with love. Oh. Hey. 
Hey! Alright! That works. I ran around with all that for just about no reason, then. Uh? Yeah. Nice. That being said, I actually do really gotta go to the... I actually do really gotta go to the bathroom, so let's take a quick break. And I'll be right back. So, boop.
Alright, I'm back, and now I got two dogs in the room to join me. Isn't that right? Wanna jump up? Show yourself off to the camera? Yeah. Yeah, I got two guests with me. Isn't that great? Yeah. So, Daddy, you let me outside for a long time, and I like that because it's cold house. It is my net. Look how snuggly this dog is right now. I'm so photogenic. Alright, you have that. Oh, Daddy, no. Daddy, wait! No, Daddy, no! Alright. Oh, let me ah, move my chair forward. Move. Let me get my phone out. And let us continue the adventure. The, the adventure of Max ignores everything else and just uses Russian stealth. Like you're not supposed to. We gotta find the butterfly key, right? Still love the idea of like, use the stealth mechanic to hide from your opponents. I'm just like, nope. <laughs> I'm too used to just die. Um. Uh. Like a baby in the straw cradle. Well, that's a place to hide if there ever was one. Oh. Uh, nice. I don't have the camera obscure though. But I think they're a matching pair of twin dolls. That's some. That's some symbolism right there. The Deonthus again. Um, where am I exactly? Okay, so, uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Y'all, this manner of sleep is getting to be a confusing place. Like, I know it's all designed to, like, mixed together but mess is getting confusing i'm trying to get to the center why wow, i went the wrong i went the long way around of the altar because if there's a place that's gonna have a camera uh, <laughs> hello he's like wait a second i don't want to stay in here what is this well, I'm not entirely sure where they want me to go. I mean, obviously, it's like, follow your sister, right? But, like, um, to, 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 to where? To where should I follow my sister? Is the question. It's a good sign. Creepiness is increasing in volume. Oh, this is gonna be awful. Uh, nope. All right, we're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. Right, let's try this door. Nope. All right. Well, <laughs> this is like, hey, eh, eh, what are you gonna do? I wonder what would have happened though if um Well this is about to be very bad. Shit! She might be helping me or she might be a detriment. I'm not entirely sure. Okay, it's a good start. Arlo, are you chewing on my chair? Like, no. <laughs> but no, they're giving me plenty of opportunities to use the hiding mechanic. But... <gasps> Wait, the projector. Uh...
ask me to do with it. Okay. I got a drop from like my man, but it's been fun today. Oh, it's all good. Thanks. And thank you so much for coming. It's always good to have you, man. Hopefully. Okay, I'll drink some water. Hopefully, me screaming at ghosts in a little bit will be somewhat entertaining. At least a little. Arlo, on the other hand, is stressed that I tricked them into staying in here. What you gonna do about it, dog? <laughs> but, um... Aw, oh, that's pretty cute. But yeah, thanks so much for stopping by. I'm willing to stick around in lurk mode. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna fumble drumble around. Alright, so now we've officially joined the rest of the manor of sleep. But... I really don't know... Okay, well now I can access that way, so that's that's good. I don't know where the uh I don't remember where the things that I can push around are. I know there's a few. But um wasn't there There's one Somewhere down there. It's going to be kind of annoying if I have to go all the way down there without having the ability to fight. Wow. Well. I don't have a real camera, so it's... Oh, she... I don't know. Oh, Arlo. Arlo, you stop that. Man, I have a real place to hide. Let's see if this works. If it doesn't, we'll juke him out. Arlo, lay down. Lay down. We're streaming. There you go. Honestly. I'm kind of wondering why I bother. Real talk, why do I even bother? I appreciate that I can spin around, though. I it, it occurred to me that I didn't try that earlier. Okay, let's see. If I don't hide, if I... I can't really tell if she's moving. Oh, she's moving. Oh, she's right there. Well, shit. I think my cover's blown. No, you didn't. Bench. See this? Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm just like, see this hot, nasty action? What are you gonna... Oh. <laughs> Alright, um... That door's blue. Let's go. Go, go. I can run faster than you. Go, 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 go. What are you gonna do about it? Go, go, go. I'm so fucking fast. Let's go into Fatal Frame 1. Well, shh. Well, okay. well, I guess who I'm following. Like, if anything, going into, um,. Excuse me, girl that I can definitely see over there. I know for a fact she's there. Okay, uh, apparently that's not the... the... Oh, she's right there. Perfect. What? Oh, were you chasing your tail? I never see you chase your tail. Oh, no! Oh! Hot! Damn! Wow, that, that hurt. But it's not insta kill, so suck it. Give me that shit. Give me that shit. Yeah! Uh, put away together with the camera obscures a book wrapped up in a. Oh, 
Hang on, Arms McGee. It's been nearly a half a month since I entered this mansion. It's still snowing outside. Once the snow melts, I'll be parted from Kyoka and most likely never be able to return. Men are not needed in the manor if necessary. I could run away, but if possible, I would like to take Kyoka with me. That feel the feel is what keeps me here. Sometimes worshippers from nearby villages come here. All of them cover their faces and head to the shrine. Today's worshipper seems like a woman. She was holding a child-sized bundle and looked as if she was crying. I also hear that lullaby. I wonder if the ceremony is like some sort of funeral. Uh, slow. Great. I had it before. Oh, use the L1 button to operate. Nice. Okay. Nice. Do you sick to Ow! Oh, that's not the button I wanted. Sick dodge. Oh, shit. Okay, let's not play that game. Um. Yeah, okay, we're gonna need at least one. Maybe two. Actually, like three. Give me that good shit. Let's load up and start a riot. Yeah, okay. We got like the arm dodge. It's time, motherfucker. Um, why do I only got two? Shit. Um, am I not doing damage? Um. Hi. Uh, sorry. If you could, if you, ma'am, if you could, if you could, if you could excuse me. Thank you. Um. Hi. I have the uh, camera obscura, and it's not letting me hurt people. There, so now that I've spent 10,000 points into this shit. Okay, I can't hurt people. Uh, or that ghost is invincible. Yeah, option one, I can't hurt people. Option two, that ghost is invincible. Either way, I'm gonna get real annoyed real quick. Okay, hold on. Um, I don't really actually know where I'm supposed to go from in here. So we're just gonna book it. Us having the camera obscure in the first place is a good start. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. What, do I have to lick it? Uh, hold on. Uh, I I can't I can't get a lock on it. I have no idea where I'm going right now. Oh wait, what what did that just say? Okay, great. Well, we're still being chased. I thought I saw her in there, but I could be totally wrong. Alright. I mean, just having the camera feels like a major upgrade. Okay. I don't know if it actually is or not, but it feels like it should be at minimum. Wait, can I crawl through here? Well, oh, shit. Every time I see those hands, I'm reminded of like Gauntlet. Like old, old Gauntlet. Well, okay, it's not Super Bowl, it's Nintendo 64 and PlayStation 2, but. Alright, give me, give me just a second. Alright, Arnold, I'm gonna trust you and Molly, so you leave me if you wanna be in here. Alright, go, 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 go. I think it's a, it's a matter of like, since the dogs know, even if she's asleep, that Megan is here, they're like, we don't need to be in here. Let us out, Daddy. So, just need to let the dogs free, because I, I know you guys can see him, but you can probably hear him just, like, running around in circles. Okay. Okay, okay. So... So I can't go that way. 
I explored everything I couldn't hear. Uh, we don't have any keys. Couldn't get anywhere in there. Couldn't get anywhere in there. Couldn't get anywhere in there. So we could try the hallway back up now that we have a camera. Um, projector room. I don't think this room actually leads to, unless it connects right there. It might connect right there. Hang on, I forget. Yeah, this one's weird compared to before. Like before it felt like there was a very clear, like beginning and end while in here, I feel like I went the completely wrong way and then was rewarded for it. Like I needed to go here. So that's why I'm confused more than anything else. This is not a connecting room because it's, it's a hidey hole. Yeah, it's a hidey hole. Okay, and then this leads to there, which doesn't help me. I'm just trying to find the butterfly key, and I can't. I couldn't, like, get a lock on the one thing. Yeah, that's the thing that gets me. That's the thing that gets me. I, I put points in. I have the camera, but I couldn't get a lock on a ghost. Like, I need some M&Ms on stream. Hope no one minds. I, I don't get it. Oh. Not sure. I thought I'd be done hiding now that I have a camera, but if anything now I'm more confused. Wasn't this son of a bitch? So I've made no progress? I've made... Wait, was this how I got in? Yes it was. Okay, also, I find it kind of interesting that, um, the guy's mechanic, right, is you can push things because you're strong, but when it comes to ghosts, you need to hide. But it's not like you're cowering. It's more like you're focused. I find that interesting. Okay, that's not it. I was going to say, if I remember correctly, that one was tightly sealed. Oh, here we go. That led us into here. Oh, that led us into here. Which. And that way was locked too. Hmm. Hmm. For sake of expediency, I might need to look up a guide. This is, I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure where they want me to go. Let's try again this way. First is this door, which is the goal. 
and then the other way all the way down. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna cheat and look this up because I feel like I missed something like obvious, you know what I mean? So just for sake of expediency, you know, keeping the episode going. Let's uh, let's look that up real quick. Okay, so final, or no, Final Fantasy. Fatal Frame 3, walkthrough. Yeah, just point me to the right room and I'll be fine. Um, guide and walkthrough. Most recommended fact of <laughs> FAQ the month winner December 2005. Thank you. I'll take it. Uh, looks like there are 13 hours and the final hour, so nice. Okay, so let's go to hour five. Main objectives. Uh, check the door in the kimono room and collect the holly hairpin from the mirror stand to unlock the door afterwards. Walk through the bell hallway to the entrance of the round window foyer to unlock the door to the hall with the tatami. Grab the camera obscure from the dresser upstairs in the hall with the tatami. Take a picture of the door on the east end that leads to the blind room. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Collect the spirit stone radio file from you as it makes the attic. Uh. 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 So I was supposed to take a picture of it, it just didn't let me. Okay. Let's see, in the hall with the tatami. Okay, so hold on. Okay, oh my goodness, we're gonna have to go all the way back, aren't we? Son of a bitch. We're gonna have to go all the way back. Wait, hold on, okay. Hall with the tatami. Okay, so we just have to get back there. So that's still a ways, but that's not as far as I thought it was. Okay, um... Yeah. I really appreciate that there's, like, this main objective thing. So that way, like, you know, all bullshit aside, what do you need to accomplish? Because that, that'll help me, like, not get any spoilers. Okay, so, yeah, we start in here, so we need to go this way. Okay, so we go this way. What annoys me is that... Uh, okay. What annoys me is that I effectively got all the way there, looked at the correct thing, tried to take a picture of it, it didn't work, and then have to walk, and then, you know, you walk all the way back over here to where the mirror is, and then you have to walk all the way back to it again. And now we have to do that an additional time, because I was looking around for it, which is weird, because I tried to take a picture of it, and it didn't work. Okay, so... This one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so it's this way. Now, I don't know which door it is. Probably that one. But we're about to find out. We gotta avoid the arm girl. Okay, uh... I don't know where the arm girl is. Okay, so it's not that one. Um, it's probably over there then. There we go. Okay, so now I gotta walk all the way the fuck back. Which, okay, it isn't actually that far. It's more annoying because I already did it.
segue. Hold on. It's, it's that door, isn't it? You know, like in the big scheme of things, it's fine. I just don't want to. So, you know, before everyone's like, Max, you're just being a whiner. Me, me, me. Well, it's just. Like, as I said, the biggest thing that annoys me in, like, honestly, in general, like, video games do this a lot, too, but, like, in, in life, is, um... Actually, I think it's hanging there. Right? Yeah, I think it's hanging right. Like, one of the biggest things that'll annoy me is when you want to do something simple or you did something, but for whatever reason it doesn't work. So you have to do it again, or you have to like, or someone's like, what do you mean? Just do X. And then you like, you keep doing X and it just doesn't work. I never get the impression you get spotted. How great would it be if, like, how great would it be if there were, like, times where, um, if you think you're hidden, like, the ghosts will move to whatever perspective you're looking at them from, so when you turn, you have to, like, look and then see they're, like, right behind you, and that's when they grab you. So I have to, have to wait for her to leave. You said you would come back. Well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Mission accomplished. I'm out. And if you're still following me, which I'm willing to bet you are, because it's kind of oh, oh, it's kind of the same room, but not really. All right, um, I hang a right. Let me through loading screen. Let me through. Is that bench? Wow, it's not even a joke. That's exactly what just happened. Um. Something about never waking from dreams for all eternity. You know what? I would like to pick up an actual battery from a camera so I could hurt people. Like, you can't just ask for that. I feel like I can. So I'm going to. I would like a way to hurt ghosts, as is my want. As is what everyone else can do. Just not me. Alright, uh... Uh... The pain engraved into the tattoo's pre tattooed priestess becomes a dream and eats away at her soul. The pain of the attached to this world is impaled as a doll died in Soul Link and enshrined in Soul Link. And the handmaid's song must be sung in prayers must be said for the priestess to lay in peace. This impalement is the duty of the handmaidens. That one handmaid was getting real freaking excited. Someone was getting real jumpy. Oh, wait. I'm so strong and so big and buff there's another thing I can move around here somewhere the heck if I know where it is that was an item uh, can, I, 
Can I pick it? Can I pick it up? <gasps> Film play on the projector. Piercing of the soul. I guess I'm guessing. Offer up the tomb of instruction, written in the ink on the etching of the soul. It's a butterfly key. Hot damn. Okay, but first. I feel like this is essential. Max, you know where you're going right now? Doing some shit. You didn't see shh. Oh, this is actually really creepy. This is actually super creepy. Oh, they're redoing different areas that we've already been in. Eh, only a handful. This is... This is creeptastic. Max, do you know where this leads? I didn't get a chance. What did it even say? Mm, that was very well done. I'm not even just saying that to say that. That was actually pretty well done, and I, I, I managed to juke it. Oh, that was well done. Just to be like her showing up there. And then just like right when I go for the door being like Meh. that that was good that was so good I don't know if she's gonna be chasing me forever now well, sh I feel like this is the obvious place that she's gonna look but let's see if it works I feel like she's gonna like walk right up on me also I don't know if this is how it works I just kind of like I kind of sit here until she leaves. Man, I'm so about to get found. Damn. Alright. Nope! Let that projectile fly on through. Alright. See, this is, if anything, this is proof. This is proof that the hide mechanic doesn't work. The high mechanic doesn't work. It's better just to fly forward at full speed. Just fucking gun it. There is no purpose to try to play coy. Alright, um, that's the staircase we gotta get to. Alright. There's no purpose to playing coy. We just, just go. My, like, they might as well replace, replace hide with shoulder check. If you see a ghost, you shoulder check it. Just drive a little into it, you know what I mean? But like, don't do that to bust open doors. So really, it's not it's not that good against like wood, but against people, it's, it's all right. The fireman kick works better. Remember to use your heel, the heel of your boot. That's what you use to kick down doors. If you use your toe, it doesn't quite work as well. So you gotta use your heel. Because in your toe, your foot bends, right? So it's like, it's, you have to like, bend against it. Fuck you, lady. I want you to know, though, your hair does look nice. It doesn't look nice when it's pinned against the fucking wall. What's up, asshole? Don't call me an asshole, fuck you. Don't chase me, don't chase me, don't chase me. Okay, go, 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 go. That should have been able to have been done way sooner. Yeah. Oh, all right, let's see what we see. Over there. 
a sec, sorry. Alright, uh, my, uh, Mio, Mio, Mayu. Hey! Also, notably, did you guys notice that when we were walking towards her, she was in the white robe back when. Son of a bitch. Okay, so. I feel like that's just a, like. See, now that I know that there's like a quick way out and like a little bit more in depth of a way out that like you accomplish a few more things. Now I'm like really suspicious. So we're just gonna kind of explore a little bit. See if we find anything different. See if we can find anything a little different. If we can't find anything a little different, then we'll go back to her. But if we can, if we can, we'll keep the party rolling. Hold on. Pressure. Uh, shot effect, repel back and damage. Use this to repel hostile ghosts. Take this to diffuse and default control settings. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Okay, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, go to use room and examine the inside of the closet. Collect the spirit stone radio and file from use attic and egg. Wait, hold on. Go go to use room. And examine the inside of the closet. Ah. Isn't this used room? Isn't this isn't this used room? Uh use attic. So I figured. Although let me do the uh let me do the uh who do you call it? The load screen. There's a doll in there. Oh, oh, I can take a picture of her. There you go. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, the shot. Ah, right, well, shit. I am buying the bullet. What the fuck? Uh? Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Save your game and walk outside of. Hold on. Sorry, sorry. Because it, it, it is nice to have like a little walkthrough here. Because every time you do something a little more, there's a secret for it. That's why I'm like. Save your game and walk outside of Ray. Save your game and walk outside of Ray's room. Oh, this is how you're supposed to. I, I confuse. I confuse him again. I confuse him again. Literally, you go to. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Okay. So I did the right thing. I like to turn off the radio. Shit. I'll skip on that just for sake of speed since I can do that. Alright, well. Woke up in the middle of the night. So I guess we're doing, um. Oh, it's coming from his room. Oh man, I don't like being handed a camera. Then being told that it can't do anything. So let's um. That's some creepy shit. Uh, I heard something. It seems to be come from inside the roof. This room is in here. What the fuck? Creepy. <laughs> Still on Nighty Patrol. Nighty Patrol. This is actually a pretty big attic for Nighty Patrol. Nighty Patrol! My flashlight's reflecting off the different. Wow, these are actually. Whoa! Wow, there's a ghost in the house now. Well, shit. So is that the dream or is that past day the dream? Uh, honestly, it hurts, but it looks to be about the same as before. So like, <laughs> well, if I'm, I know the first thing I, a dream. Well, I know the first thing I would do. Step one, grab the safe state or step one, grab the camera obscura. Step two, we're doing another fucking nighty patrol. But you just did a nighty patrol. Yeah, I know. First thing we're doing is we're grabbing our camera. I just sent me. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I, I thought I thought she was in her bed. I was gonna say first fucking thing we're doing is we're grabbing the camera obscure. We're going to that. We're going to that fucking attic. Think we're gonna think. Think I'm just gonna be like, yeah, I'll leave a creepy crawler gross in there. Yeah, whatever, it's fine. Ain't no thing. No, we're going. Um. Yeah. First things first. Ooh. As mentioned previously, occultist Kunihiko Asu has actively appropriated Western craft with the goal of, ex of explicating ancient Japanese belief in, in the legends of the other world. It's said he is finally able to establish communication with the other world. 
The first example of this is the other world crystal radio single receiver. Or is those the Spirit Stone Radio? The Spirit Stone's radio uh the Spirit ra the Spirit Stone Radio Spirit Stone was the name his colleagues used later, and Dr. Asus Easter Spirits is usually referred to as the crystal. The principle of the crystal radio is that it utilizes special wave detection property of crystal to pick up the appropriate band of wavelength. As you focus on the fact that stones have been known from ancient times to carry occult properties. If you can find a special crystal, he uh, crystal, he thought the uh, pro he if he could find a special crystal, he, the thought, perhaps he could capture signals from the other world. I thought that was my own dyslexia kicking in there. Uh, it is said his experiment was success, and the, records, and the records note that he was able to capture sound at a range outside that of normal broadcasting. The documentation of the sounds have been lost, so Sue's associate left behind several testimonials saying they heard words of the past and words of ghosts. You know, take me ain't you? that dream I had yesterday. Third round of 90 patrol. <laughs> Shit never ends. 90 patrol never ends. I didn't do anything the rest of that day. Gray, what's the matter? Her book transformed in front of my eyes. Ray? Here. Ray bought that photo of the doll in the skewer. I wasn't able to find anything on it. I saw it maybe similar to the legends of the straw dolls passed on in Tono. Anyway, I might have something to do with folklore, so you might find something in one of the used books. Thanks, I'll go take a look. You can ask me whatever you want. Oh, I'm, okay? gonna, I'm gonna ask you more things. I'm gonna ask you I'm gonna ask you more things. I'm, I'm still I'm still talking to you. It's raining again. I'm still gonna talk to you. It's raining again. I'm still gonna talk to you. It's raining again. And I'm on my way in my nutty back to you's room. You's gonna get a fistful of camera obscura. And now I have an extra step. Gotta go check the attic. Confirm ghost sighting. I hear that. In many regions, particularly in the mountain areas, there remains a folk practice of dressing up dolls that they make from straw, earth, or cloth and worshiping them as idols. The doll in the picture is poured by the Aeros resident. It is called Kishumi, or so it dies in the village, they weave their hair of the deceased into the straw and have it wear his or her coat. That's weird. The doll is fixed onto skewers and put and put before a shrine at the edge of the mountain. The doll is enshrined for up to one month after the death, and after that period passes, it is cast into the river behind the shrine together with various offerings. In this region's tradition, there is said to be a cave in the mountain connected to the land of the gods. The dead who became Kashumi stand between the village and the mountain. They take upon the e village's evil and head to the land of the gods. In a neighboring village, there is said to be a similar doll called the Igushi, but this one is the spirit of a person who died young and is deified in the mountains. In one interpretation, both village and mountain have a protective deity standing in the border between people and gods. In another sense, burning the dead with evil or deifying the spirit of the young in a mountain connotes human sacrifice. Nope. I fucking heard creepy sounds oh, I guess the area is clear the physics on that on the curtains looks pretty good I'm hearing a lot of creepy noises in here. A lot of whispering. But unfortunately, none of my apparatus has actually worked. Also, I'm hearing it everywhere. Seems like you're having a lot of nightmares lately. Nighty patrol never rests. Are you all right? Nighty patrol never rests. It's raining again. Nighty patrol never rests. You're you're joining me on nighty patrol. I can't. I I need to sleep. Let me go to sleep. Like no. Nighty patrol never sleeps. Yes, you do. No, we don't. 
We must protect this cat right here at all costs. This cat is incredibly important. Okay, we can't we can't just we can't just let this cat down. Nighty patrol. Nighty patrol. I heard that. Oh my goodness, that mark on the wall is getting bigger. That is so getting bigger. Oh my goodness, it's getting bigger. Son of a bitch. We have fucking water damage. Son of a bitch. It's a nice house. We're paying off the mortgage. We're doing good. Got fucking water damage. Yeah, I get someone to check that out before it gets too bad. Get these creepy ass voices out of here too. Second. All right, ninety patrol complete. <whistles> Hearing creepy sounds. Also, I feel like I got some snaps on my sinus. Wonder if we can do something. Ah, of all the places to wake up, of all the place, the sacrificial, the sacrificial pillar. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, my throat's like not feeling very well. We'll tough through for a bit longer, but I might end a little bit earlier as a result. Okay, well. Since I don't, since every time I come here, I don't know which doors are and aren't operational. I don't really know what my goals are either, so I'm just kind of wondering. I now know what my goals are. Excellent. Ooh. Oh, that's slow. That that purple is slow. Okay. Um, an image of something that's been caught in the photo. It's four dudes ready to kick your ass. Hmm. I don't know where that is. I'm not just saying that. I actually, I actually don't really know where that is. If it, it, it I mean, it, it just showed a bunch of dudes. Wait, I tell, I tell to protect that. Look at that fucking water damage. Look at that bitch running at me. Hmm. Kind of hoping it would give me another look at that picture. I guess not. Nah. <sighs> oh, I guess only certain people have each one. Okay. Now yeah, we might call it early. I, I just feel kind of beat. All right. Um. We're just gonna save up our points. Wait, hold on, what? Max spirit power charge. If you power up, possible charge amount increases. 
Max spirit power charge versus displace the max amount you can charge your spirit power. Hold on. So do I actually need this if I want it to be stronger? Or is that the specials? Let's test it. Yeah, it's three. Okay, okay, yeah. So that, that's okay. So I just wasted 10,000 points, but that's okay. Now we know. Your mother isn't enough. For me! Ah, shit, where is she? Where, where is she? Uh. What was that in there? Oh! I like that little spin. Alright. Hi ho, hi ho. Ghost, but um, that's the nearest projection room. So if we go out this way and hang right, we should be able to get to the projector room. Heck, we got like three different things to put. Get back! Stay away! Oh, that's a good sign. I'm gonna go towards it. I'm pretty good at that. I'm pretty good at making poor life choices. All right, here we go. All right, uh, let's start with piercing of soul, just because it's in order. There we go. There we are. Put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> That's not a very good film. All right, what about unknown? Wow, I don't like that. Wow, there's someone in the back. I saw it for a split second. I think there's someone, oh, oh, oh. It was this room and some moon around in it. Oh, that's creepy. I don't know where that is. I, um... I don't, I don't, I don't know where that is. One of those kind of looked like a garden. It's about all I got. So, I don't really know where to go. And I'm gonna be honest, I am lacking brain power currently. If I should go, just go towards whenever I hear the uh, I just walk out the front door and I just leave the dream. I don't discover shit and my soul gets taken over by a tattoo. Fantastic. <laughs> okay, I think that's a good hint. 
I think that's a good hint. Let's go fuck up a ghost. He needs a minute on the toilet. Well, shit, what am I supposed to do? I gotta go all the way around. I gotta, I gotta go. But that door was shut tight. So we have to go all the way, hit up that door, hit up that door, go all the way down, just so I can go all. Wow, that is exactly what I have to do. I better run into every other freaking ghost I need. Because if I don't. I better run into every other freaking ghost I need. Because if not, this is going to be one big goose chase. I'm going to put a stake in you. See, see this, see this little piece of wood? See this little piece of metal or whatever? Gonna go right in your chest. Okay, okay. How do I even get to the one area that guy? Yeah, yeah. How do, how do I even get to that? Ah, I gotta go there. Which maybe I should have done earlier. I can go. I can go over there. Oh my goodness! I, this is. I feel so lost, and I am lacking so much brain power. Again. She wasn't that bad to fight, but. Oh, wait, I, I can't actually. Oh, my goodness, I am. I know that. Wrong way. There you are. There. Good deal, bitch. Wow, I could just do that shit for free. That's way better. Get fucking wrecked. But no, that, that one I could just do when I felt like it. I didn't have to like take a picture, it didn't take ammo. You just like, you just apply it. That's pretty nice. Oh, hey, perfect. Observe. Oh, bench. Give me a triple. That's one. But build your repair in the Kusa Shrine in the last passage. All the carpenters of the Moria family, except for the leader, must be prepared to stay behind, never to return. The soon one who exceeds in their craft, all the carpenters must fulfill their duty to protect the secrets of the shrine by being buried as a sacrificial pillar is lining it. The remaining Moria Carpenter must have become the master builder to ensure that the craft is carried on to the next generation. That fucking sucks. So I got snotling pretty hard right now. Oh, 
Okay. Um, well, let's check out this one. It might connect to where that other, where that palanquin was. Ah, damn it. Okay, never mind. I appreciate that they put that text there, but if anything, it's confusing me. Like, I'm not entirely sure where it's coming from. So I don't know if I can even solve it. Um... I don't think there's anything here. I forgot that I could do this. Where's that bow? Ah, you can't kick it. I was kind of hoping you could. Totally going towards the source of the sound. All right, girly. There's a lot of voices going on in here. Uh, read screens were. This is where she was before. It'd be kind of cool if, like, you could only see her through the camera. And she was, like, in position right there. No? This is just weird and creepy. Now, don't get me wrong. It's pretty weird and creepy. But we've dealt with worse, so, you know. Might also try to zap us on the way out, though. Nope. Let us leave. Okay, and okay, now we need to go, I guess, down this way. God, I'm not sure exactly where to go. All I really know is, like, follow the blood. Which, I mean. It's very outlast of me. Just like blood knows where to go, find more blood. Oh god, okay. Um uh, Just crawl through right there. Oh, hold on, hold on. Stay aside for a second there. That doesn't still doesn't let me in. But at least now, like the screaming ended. Still not letting me in though. So this area is just barred off completely. But we can still get through that north part, so it's mostly fine. Hmm. Adventure of that's a oh Yo Manch 
not really a good spot to fight. A little better. All right. Yeah, come at me. Come at me. I say, why do I get the impression you're not coming at me? Me! Oh! Oh shit! You worked me into a hallway. Me! That's right. Oh, was he not one of the? Ah, damn it! I was kind of hoping he was one of the pillars. Um, that's the exit. Exit. I think. God, I don't know. There's a whole lot of. Whole. Use me. Yeah. You... As a sacrifice. Oh shit. Me. Oh, this might not work. Dude's got combos. Alright. He's just kind of swinging. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. There he is. Woo! Yeah, then we'll work around the corner. Yeah, hit him with another. got him in on that one okay let that charge up I don't know if that's that let me get out while charging up Woo! and nice shot of your collarbone I have no idea how I'm finding these people Oops, the rift shrine was something. The shrine of sleep is sealed within a dream to prevent the priestess from escaping the spread of the rift. To keep the rift from spreading, we must ensure that she stays staked down and pray for eternal sleep. The rift. The rift, you say. Lovely. I tell us it out so it won't work, but I'm curious. <laughs> so what's the what happens there's gotta be there's gotta be different endings right if you just like take the option to leave every time what happens because like no way no way the game's like yep you did it good job 100 percent that was that was the right thing to do you did it you know you 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 escaped that that's the goal and you did you, you did it you're smart no way, no way, like there's, there's gotta be something more going on than just that, right? Why would they actively encourage you to not play the game? Um, let's try over there. Wasn't there somewhere around here, there was like someone, oh hey. Wasn't there something somewhere around there with like someone blocking a door? Okay. I don't remember. Okay, we'll work our way up. Oh, 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 oh. Someone not happy to see me. Someone was getting some flashbacks of whoop ass. This is every else saw.
I don't think this is a real lullaby. I think this is programming a child that they're gonna do some weird shit and like trying to make them cool with it. Which is creepy. And I don't like it. Uh... Alright, someone down there doesn't like me. Don't know why, I haven't done anything. Alright, um... Hmm, I don't even know where to go. Am I supposed to be a threat? Sup, asshole? Alright. I'll investigate you. You. You're <laughs> Uh, I was gonna say, I thought I got the bell tower key at one point. Alright, well. These people sacrifice. Uh. Oh, oh, God. See, uh, uh, <gasps> it's just a shit ton of damage. Damage slow. Yeah. Yeah. I would like to equip it immediately. But yeah, they just gave me that. They just gave me that one, um, that thing is like, oh yeah, you just now you just have to figure out where that is and go back to it. I don't know where that is to save my life. Like, I I I really like how big the map is in this game, but my goodness, I don't know shit. Kind of want to upgrade. The force of your shot, the effect of time increases. I do just like straight damage. But we need to, um. Spirit power recharge rate. Yeah. Like, on one side. On one side. Okay, I just completely lost my train of thought. I apologize. On one side, I'm really liking just like how big and laid out and intricate this this place is, and like it is very clearly one structure. So you know it's a bit. Uh... Oh, this is um. Yeah, this is the Fatal Frame 1 area. Uh, okay. Jeez. Like, this this area is so big. I'm just having such a, just an absolute struggle remembering where shit is. And then, like, I'm discovering new shit. I don't even know that Mayor of Sleep Grand Staircase. Oh my goodness. Gee, I, I'm thinking we're going to need to end the episode soon because I'm just. My brain is just not operating correctly right now. So. I feel bad. Like, I feel like I'm not giving my, like, fullest to the situation. And hey, you know, sometimes days are like that. That's okay. Nothing's wrong with that. I ASMR voiced a little too hard and now I'm ill. Yeah, so we'll, we'll keep making our way towards what I hope is progress, but um... Is this where I need to go? No, 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 no. I haven't tried over there yet. 
yeah, when, when we hit a stay, it, when we hit a save, especially if we're just like wandering or at least they cordon off the areas. I just wish it was more obvious. All right. Um, yes, I'm going all the way down. Yeah, I'm just, this area is so big and a lot of the things aren't the most recognizable. And I'm hearing more voices. That being said, um, I, th I talked about this a little bit before. Fatal Frame 1 and 2, I think they do a really good job of being subtly scary. And like... Sup, asshole? Sup, crawly girl? How's it going? Yeah, that's right. Get the fuck out of my attic. I know, I know your ass in my attic. Alright, get out. You ain't paying rent. You don't get to scrabble around up there pretending to be a cockroach when... In the middle of the night. No. Fuck you. Max, what are you talking about? I don't know. It's I told you, my brain's melting right now. Did I just magically go the right way, though? I did. All right, there's a save spot. Yeah, let's um, let's just go there and call it. Once again, apologies for any a little sooner than normal, but I'm... My brain is not in the right headspace to do this kind of shit. I feel like I'm missing obvious shit. So I apologize for that. The game's like, wow, you wandered around like a Nimrod a lot. But, um, just to kind of finish my thought, I'm really impressed, just for funsies, as I talk, I'm going to leave this here because I did that once on accident before. And, um, I did this once on accident before and it just started doing creepy shit. But, um, what was I going to say? Um, this game is making a lot of rooms and a lot of places way creepier way scarier between the voices in the walls the chipping in the distance the like the flickering room and stuff just how all the ghosts look this game is like honestly i remember people saying like fail frame 2 is the best one in the franchise hands down i'm starting to lean towards three because there's a lot of things they're doing to scare you that I think are really good. And in my heart of hearts, I can feel like Game Boy, or not Game Boys, um, fanboys, the uh, fanboys of the game going like, it's better in two because it's more subtle and blah, blah, blah. But like, I'm really liking this, to be honest. This is really creeping me out and I'm 100% for it. And it's not like it ain't coming with the music and the sound effects, cause it is. But, um, yeah, we need to end the episode off here. Uh, next time we stream is going to be on Wednesday, where we're going to be doing something special. I'm really excited for it. And, um, yeah, assume, like, assuming that doesn't happen, though, we'll continue with Fatal Frame 3. Uh, or, sorry, if that doesn't happen, I shouldn't say assuming. The backup is just continuing with Fatal Frame 3. And then on Friday, um, we haven't really fully committed to what we're going to be doing on Friday. Uh, some people joked about doing an Elden Ring randomizer for a stream. Or if, um, that tinnitus, or if we're just going to start our next side game, or if I really just need to do Metroid, I was thinking that this game was going way faster. So I don't know if we will do Metroid or if, um, honestly, I've been feeling some Dark Souls games recently, so we might start Mortal Shell. I'm incredibly indecisive as you guys can tell. So, um, yeah, in the discord, it's kind of like, Hey, what do you guys think we should do? Um, I was considering scoring, but I haven't bought it yet, so I need to get around to that. Um, yeah, that'll be on Friday, and then guaranteed Fatal Frame 3 next Monday. Next Monday, so, you know, happy Thanksgiving is Fatal Frame. Uh, now Switch will be on uh, Twitter, Discord, and Facebook because I suck at social media. The bottom will be put YouTube relatively quickly. And, yeah, I think that's everything. Let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all have fun. I know I did. I'm surprised nothing creepy has happened yet, to be honest. I know creepy shit does happen. Now, anyway, what are you going to do? Um, yeah, so let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all have fun. I know I did, and I will see you. There you go, then. Thank you so much for coming. Bye! Boop!